Good morning, you guys. I am still sick. Nothing new there. This is becoming part of our brand, part of what we do. Um, I'm feeling so much better, but I'm still coughing, sneezing, and my voice is basically not back to normal yet. Um, I had a very chill morning, then I texted my cousin who is visiting here from London and see if she wants to do something. And um, she was like, yeah, let's just go shopping. Just look around the stores and all of that. So we're gonna go to Glendale Mall and um, Home Goods and Marshalls probably. Um, I'm in a desperate need of a new nose ring because not nose, it's not a ring, but like piercing basically. Because I've had this for a very long time and it's losing the shine and all of that. So I need a new one. And there's this little kiosk at um, Glendale Galleria that sells it. So I'm thinking of going there and buy a new one. I don't need anything specific to be honest with you guys. And one of my 2020 resolutions, if you guys read the blog, is to save more money and spend less on clothing. We're gonna try to do a window shopping so we don't spend too much money and only buy what we actually need. And we'll see where the day is going. It's a beautiful sunny day, like a beautiful sunny day. I have to like... I should open this up. So I'm just gonna go pick up my cousin and take you guys along with us our day of shopping. Target and Marshalls. And as other nice things, Marshalls. Marshall. Marshall. <laughs> so we bought few, like, I don't know why, we only bought beauty stuff. So I wanted to show you guys because she bought a mask that I'm obsessed with and I want to show it to you guys. It's this L'Oreal, I don't even know how do you, how do you spell this? Alvive? Alviv. Alviv okay <laughs> i've used this mask before it's one of the best drugstore masks if you have blonde hair i use this even instead of conditioner when you use this you don't even need a conditioner so i wanted to show you guys this but i didn't buy it she bought it um i got the dove go fresh pear and aloe vera body wash this smells really good then i bought my collagen powder the vival protein this is really good. I'm writing a blog post about all the vitamins I'm taking. I'm going to include this and go into details of why am I taking it and what it does. Marshalls had really good um, sheet masks. I bought sheet masks. So one of the ones that I got is Radiance Boost Vitamin C. And these ones were a pack of 10 and it was only $6.99. So that was a good one. Um, this is a green tea, especially if you have rosacea, green tea sheet mask is really good. And the other one that I got is the collagen one because we all need collagen because we don't want to be wrinkly. And then I bought this um, face razors. I get uh, laser hair removal on my face, but every time before going, you have to shave your face. Also, if you have dead skin, this is fantastic no the hair doesn't grow thicker it doesn't work like that if you use a face razor um so i like this for that too is that it that's all i mm -hmm. got so boring basically only shift <laughs> masks so yeah that's all like we got i'm holding adana here hostage <laughs> until i can do my <laughs> haul and then she can leave can i leave <laughs> yeah you can leave oh you bought an eyelash curler yeah it doesn't have extra it does her. oh yeah it does mm -hmm. So I can Comfort, grip, intense curl. We'll see. 
You know I'm scared of using these. Why? I've not, that's why I get lash lifts. Because I'm deadly. I'm used to it. Deadly scared of this. <laughs> Every time that Anya does my makeup, I don't even let her apply mascara. Really? I do it. And my under uh, inner eye thing. I don't um, know. I'm just so used to it now. Don't you pinch your eye? No. I mean, once or twice at the start, I did, <sighs> but it's I'll fine. Die. Nothing really That's happens. That's why I love the lash lift. If you try lash lift, it's going to change your life for I the know. rest of your Can life. Can you imagine how long it's going to touch my Have you seen Avenues? She's getting them redone today because one of her eye was like straighter. Yeah. Like she has lashes and like they look. I'll do it. Okay, thank you for hanging thank out with you. me today. Thank I'll you. I'll talk to you. Bye. Bye. I hope you feel better. Thank as well. you. <laughs> bye. Hi, to everyone. I love. Bye. There is nothing that can hold us back, hold us back. We can do what we want to do. Because we got all. I just got back from shopping and it's I think 4 35 p.m. Um, and I'm a little bit hungry we're invited to my um, uncle's house tonight um, so I don't want to eat too much to fill me off so I can eat at night um, but I'm gonna just make tomato soup with some garlic bread for now just so I can feel a little bit full and I have to get up and get ready to go to my um, uncle's house basically this is my favorite tomato soup from Trader Joe's. I like it to be a little bit more spicy, so I add a little bit of chili flakes on it. So I have my makeup on already, like from earlier in the morning uh, when I did my makeup, so I'm not gonna take it off and reapply it. I'm just gonna vamp it up a little bit for the nighttime. And how I do it is basically I darken a little bit of shadow, put eyeliner, a powder, blush, and put back on my highlighter and um, lips basically. So <clears throat> I'm gonna show you to you guys how I do it. Um, I use the uh, Zola and ColourPop Brunch Date Palette. This is my most used palette. And I'm just going to increase and darken it a little bit. I mean, it depends on what look you want to go for but like i never do like crazy eyeshadow looks and then i go in with an eyeliner let's hope i'm not gonna mess up it, mess it up i'm gonna do a little teeny tiny i'm not doing a like wing liner or anything just a teeny tiny like liner just to shave my eye They're not completely equal, cool, but this is the best that I can do. Um, do I smoke out under my eyes? Yeah, why not? Let's just smoke it a little bit. Then I go in with my Charlotte Tilbury powder. This is the best powder. I'm going with my blush and using the Milani Luminoso. Luminoso. Laura Geller, Gilded Honey. You all know it already. Charlotte Tilbury, Lip Cheat in Pillow Talk. Then Dose of Color, Liquid Lipstick in Color, Truffle. And for the center of the lid, Dose of Color, Let's Cuddle, just in the middle. So I'm done with the makeup and I'm not doing anything to my hair, it's just staying in a bun. Now I'm gonna figure out what am I gonna wear. Probably I'm gonna wear the same top. Probably I'm gonna wear the same outfit as this morning. Yeah, and we're gonna head out to go to my uncle's house. I'm actually gonna leave you guys here and I'm not gonna take my camera with me uh, because my uncle and my aunts are gonna be there and I don't wanna make them uncomfortable. Um, so I will see you guys tomorrow morning.
I'm out of breath. This was very difficult for me. Good morning. Oh my god, I'm so out of breath, I can't even talk. Let me catch my breath first. This is so much harder than what I thought it would be. I mean, the exercises were not very difficult. I will link the um, two videos that I did for you guys. I did two 10 minutes videos. The exercises were not like ridiculously hard. It I, like I typed in like easy at home workouts, um, but like I haven't worked that in. I had my surgery almost seven months ago, and probably two months before that I didn't work out. Like nine, ten months, I haven't worked out even the tiniest bit. So like my legs are shaking right now. <laughs> So, but I'm so happy I did it. The sweat makes me feel good. And that's the number one reason I love working out because the sweat makes me feel good. I love doing this. Like, it, it feels good. It feels good. Um, I usually like to shower right after when I work out, but because I put Olaplex in my hair, I'm just gonna wait like a couple of hours and then shower. Now I'm gonna go make myself a smoothie and then shower, then I will speak to you guys. The smoothie that I'm going to have is the Revive um, Ready to Blend Smoothie. This one is the pink dragon one. And in the back you have dragon fruit, strawberry, leche, kiwi, banana, beets, chai seed, and flax seeds. Um, so you get them ready, like you keep them frozen. You just basically take this off. So you have everything already inside. So you just pour either your water, milk, almond milk whatever you want your liquid of choice until the top and you empty all of this into blender and then you can pour it back into this cup and have it from this cup because this has a straw holder or you can put it in any jar that you want the days that i'm home i use my own glasses but the days that i'm on to go um like i have to run out so i just use this cup so i can just trash it basically Obviously you can use straws if you want, but with my surgery it's recommended to not use a straw, so I don't use a straw. How many times did I say straw? It probably will take like an hour for me to finish this, but um, that's a whole joy of it honestly, that I don't consume all of it at once. So yeah, cheers. Four hours later, I'm finally washed, clean, and all of that. Uh, I'm getting ready to go to Whole Foods. Tomorrow I have a um, few of my previous co-workers coming to our house. Like, I need to go to grocery shopping. So I'm gonna go to Whole Foods and Trader Joe's to get a few bits. I wanna see if in Whole Foods I can find a little plant for my um, pot, the white pot that I showed you guys in the previous vlogs. Um, I haven't got a plan for that yet and we're planning on finally finally <laughs> get out of our Christmas decoration this weekend so I want to like be prepared to put back to put back the decorations in change a little bit of stuff in the house I don't know yet I'm playing with it I even forgot what we have so we had our Christmas stuff out for two months I completely even forgot what decor we had before that um, but yeah I want to buy a money tree from Whole Foods I don't know if they have it or not so we're gonna see and I want to cook too I saw this delicious looking dish over on Pinterest the other day so I'm gonna buy stuff to make that and obviously I'll make it with you guys and that's about it so let me show you guys my outfit and we're gonna head out to shopping here is my very chanel inspired outfit of the day um i'm wearing this tank top from uh, boohoo this jacket is from jessica london my chanel brooch because this jacket is giving me all the chanel vibes my belt is gucci jeans are asos and the uh, dsw shoes that i got um like years ago that they're very Chanel inspired and my Chanel bag this is my outfit of the day so we're gonna head out and I'll take you guys along I 
just got back home from shopping and um, Whole Foods didn't have the money tree that I wanted. They said they're gonna order it and probably get it next week. But I got the most beautiful pink hydrangeas. I'm gonna put those in the water and then I'm gonna start cooking because I'm extremely hungry. And obviously I'll take you guys along with me. So I just started cooking and I'm gonna show you guys what I'm cooking. It's basically a very simple dish of like chicken uh, with um, Greek salad on top. Something similar to Greek salad. Um, so I'll show you guys what I did until now. For now, I put the chickens in the um, pot with red wine and a little bit of olive oil, salt, pepper, um, garlic powder, onion powder, and oregano, and I'm gonna let it cook really well. After it's completely cooked, I'm gonna put it in our panini maker. I'm gonna put it in there um, for them to be grilled, basically. Um, and then we're gonna make the salad together. So for our salad, these are the items that we need. Feta cheese, basil, red onion, lemon, olives, cucumber, and cherry tomato. So I'm gonna cut all of this and then we're gonna marinate it with um, red wine vinegar. I'm gonna use this tool to like give patterns to the cucumber so they look cute. I just put all the chickens um, with those are garlics on top into the oven I'm not gonna use the uh, panini press because the oven is gonna be just faster uh, so I just put all of them in the oven so I'm gonna do 450 degrees for probably 20 to 30 minutes but they're all completely um, crispy and like grilled basically now my salad is almost ready so we have tomatoes the cheese um, cucumber red onion olives and fresh oregano and basil and i did salt pepper lemon juice and a little bit of this red wine vinegar and now i'm gonna mix it all in and move on to making my um, quinoa Now I'm gonna make my quinoa and I just basically do it with water. The only thing that I add on it is this 21 seasoning, salute seasoning from Trader Joe's. Just a little bit of it in the water and then I cook my quinoa. The food is finally ready. We have our chicken, the salad and I cooked some quinoas. Now I'm gonna put it all in one dish and enjoy it because I'm very hungry. The food was absolutely delicious. I just wish the chicken were not as dry because I put them in the oven for a very high degree and they were very dry so I wish they were a little bit softer uh, but the taste of it was amazing. I'm gonna finish off the vlog here um, because there's nothing interesting that is gonna, ha gonna happen for the rest of the day. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe. And hit the like button and I will see you guys on my next vlog. Bye!